Hey, good looking. I'm Vixen, and welcome back, or welcome for the first time. In the last episode, this happened. Move like the wind! Woo! <laughs> Let the epic story continue. Okay. <laughs> last time I played this, this was so glitchy, I couldn't actually, I thought there was a hole in the ground because I couldn't actually see the ground. Oh wait, hold on, there's stuff here. Uh, we've got some more suits, we've got this box, we've got this lovely view of rock, some sort of emergency life support, I think it might not be on. Yeah, I can literally see through the walls. Uh, there's nothing in there. It's just uh, stuff. Okay, 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 okay. This is a wow. Right, good, good. God, oh my. I hate that sound, I hate that sound, I hate that sound! That like, wah, wah, that sound in my ear just every single time, it gets me, it gets me, it gets me. Hello? Hello? Catherine? Be quiet! Don't look at it! <gasps> run, 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 run and be quiet. Okay, 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 okay. We're safe, we're safe, we're safe, we're safe! <laughs> Um, um, ah! is it gone? I think it's safe to come out now. God almighty, I hate that thing. I don't know what it is, but it's disgusting and really creepy. Simon, are you there? Yes. Okay, 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 okay. Okay, okay, okay. How do I... Isn't this where it went? Catherine? No? No. One of these doors? It must have gone in here. It's weird. Yes. Hello. Simon, right here. I see you. No, not you too. I was really hoping you were human. Don't let the circuitry fool you. I was human once. I can't take any more. This is... Everything's fucked. I give up. There's nothing left. <laughs> Calm down. Such a I'm drama queen. Old. You sure? Well, it is. It sure as hell looks like it. For all I know, there's no one left except for me. What do you mean? I'm right here. Don't take this the wrong way. But I meant any humans left except for me. Have you looked at yourself lately? You're a walking, talking diving suit with some electronics left on for good measure. I... I don't... You don't want to think about it? We'll start thinking about it. I... I, I don't want to do this anymore. I don't want to be this. I want out. Before you do anything hasty, could you help me with something? <laughs> what? I was trying to find out what happened with my project when that brute knocked me to the ground. Your project? How could anything possibly matter when you know you're a stupid robot in a stupid dead world? Okay. Calm yourself. Focus. I need you to fix me so I can get back to work. Then you can sulk as much as you want. You gotta be kidding, right? I think I have a better chance of building myself a time machine than of putting you back together. I just need to access the computer. Oh, is that an Omni tool you're carrying? Yes. Oh, the door opener? I picked it up at Upsilon where I woke up. I don't have to do. Plug it into the terminal. Sure, whatever. <laughs> uh. 
Ah! When the Omni Tool is loaded, just plug my Cortex chip into the tool. What's a Cortex chip? It will be obvious. I'll eject it for you. Just grab the chip and slide it into the Omni Tool. Come on, I just need you to do this one thing for me. Sure, whatever. They're both quite like childish in their own way, both Simon and Catherine. I mean, I'm not going to spoil anything, but like, what was that? Just plug it into the terminal. Yeah, I. Oh, look. I guess she was trying to make an Omni tool again. Right, so we plug it in here. Welcome, Louise Moran. Activated. The Omni tool is ready now. Yeah, I Should can see that. Should be easy enough. Just pick up the chip and slide it into the Omni tool. Why does a robot chip fit a door opener? It's standardized connect. Well, it does a lot more than Catherine? open doors. We watched the initiation All video. Right. Let's give this a try. Did that have stuff on it? I think it did. Yeah, it does. Custom Cortex chip found. Shutting down Helper Jane. Sorry, Helper Jane. Just pretty much anything will fit. Oh, this feels weird. Times 11 times 12. I'm in the Omnitool? Thanks. So, what's the project about? My project? Oh, well, I saved all the people on the station as brain scans and put them into an artificial world. We were going to launch it into space to save it from, uh, well, all of this. Are you telling me that you were going to launch a computer world filled with people into space? Yes. It was just a pet project at first, but it got really serious after the comet took out the surface. Then suddenly it became very important, and it was officially named the Ark. That's appropriate. How far did you get? I don't know. That version of me that I am. It came from a scan I did pretty early on. The living Catherine could very well have finished the project and launched it. I guess she could even still be alive. Uh, weird thought. So the talking robots, are they also scans you did? They could be, but I doubt it. I'd expect much more sense if that was the case. Ah, all right, silent. What's happening? I managed to receive <laughs> some data from the backup server. This should tell us everything we need. Oh. Could you do me a favor and run into the other room and have a look? I don't seem to be able to view the files in this condition. I need to know that the Ark is safe. Sure, Kath. Thanks. I'll unlock the door for you. I like how, like, a second ago, he was basically... What was it said before? You're from Toronto? Yes. Yeah, I just went in for a brain scan, and suddenly, here I am. That doesn't make any sense. How... Why would anyone bring a scan from Toronto? You think that's strange? What if I tell you it was back in 2015? Whoa. Okay, we're done. I can move on. Yeah, it's weird how a second ago he was like, God, I'm the only human left! And now he's already given her a nickname. It's just like, Kath. Sure, Kath. Uh, we've been friends forever, Kath. Oh, my torch was on that entire time. That's a waste of... So freaky looking, so freaky looking. Okay, okay. Okay, 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 hold on a second. I'm still trying to figure out how you got here. I just want to see in here. I'd really like to know who thought sending a Canadian to the bottom of the sea was a good idea. God, it's dark in here. My God, look at how dark it is. It's freaky. It scares me. I don't like it. Oh, Jesus. Careful. I think it's back. Keep your eyes peeled. Okay. Okay. Not going in that place ever again. Is it here? Seriously, heart palpitations every time. Did it just lock? <laughs> yeah, that was orange. Oh, no. Okay. What? Whatever. Okay. What happened before? I guess we're okay. Strangely overbearing. Yeah, it basically exploded with electromagnetism. That's bad for us, right? Confusing at least. Gives the senses a good punch. Right? Where am I? 
Oh, this is the room that she asked me to go into. Okay, I've explored. Last time I didn't get to explore everything because I got freaked out by the thing. But it seems like there wasn't really anything to explore anyway. Oh, there's a thing on this. Look at this. Message. Chris from Matthias Josik. Josik? I stayed up all night. Chris, I stayed up all night. Seemed like a waste to sleep. I got the TV on in the background. The newscasters are covering the incoming comments like they were counting down for New Year's Eve. I know it's messed up wishing you were here with me. I suppose if anyone has a chance to survive this thing, it would be you guys below the waves. I hope you're able to go on, if it's a life worth living. Looks like the is about to hit the fan. I better hit send before the shockwave reaches us. I'm proud of you, boy. Dad. There's really no way around That's this. so Looking depressing. Killed the planet. Afraid so. You were all stranded down here. And we were the lucky ones. When did my torch go off? So I'm looking. Oh, there he is. What are you doing? Be careful. I was sure that happened last time. No. Easy. Easy like Sunday morning. Gonna be high, so high. Uh. Uh. Is this the other room? No, 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 I need to go back to the start. This is it, right? Yes, yes, okay. Which room am I supposed to go into? I don't know. This one? What happened to the tower and the dock and the welcome center? I don't know what any the of that tower? means. What are you talking about? This place is in ruins. Well, obviously. All the camera shows static. It's, it's so strange. These windows haven't been cleaned in a while either, Kath. Right, touch this. Oh yeah, just stick your fist in there. <sighs> oh, he didn't make that uh, sound. I'm gonna miss that. Right. With this, we've officially been into every door. I guess the thing wasn't back, I Nothing. suppose that was just a- yeah, what? Just check the computer. Yes, look for anything about the Ark. Ooh! Right, lots of signs point to stuff being down. Right, let's do what we're supposed to be doing. Look at this. Lambda Ark data. Opinion poll. Interview one. Robin Bass or Bass? Are you excited about the arc? At first, I couldn't really see the point of it. But then I thought, why shouldn't we, right? I mean, if we are able to save even just a small piece of ourselves, why wouldn't we do that? So you are in favor then? I think it's really important we do this. So, like, I suppose if you have a good enough and a complete enough scan, the scanned, like, the copy version of yourself wouldn't realise that they weren't actually them, which I guess is what happened with Simon, which is why he thought he was human. And what Catherine was just talking about, you know, why would ever anyone be, bring a scan from Toronto? So he's a copy of the original Simon. But obviously he just woke up, like, the copy of himself woke up thinking like that he no time had passed so he thinks he is the original so every copy would think that they were the original which is kind of weird when you think about it ian pedersen what are your thoughts pedersen? on the ark it's a great idea finally we have something to do am i right are you optimistic about the project chances of um about the ark reaching space yeah, it can definitely be done you already solved the biggest problem, how to actually get us all in there. Now all we have to do is build the damn thing, and hope Phi is still operational. Yeah, I think we can do it, but it's not going to be easy. 
when when did the comet hit it hit in may april i forget but this is like a couple of months or a month after mark sarang what are your thoughts on the art project the idea is just incredible by every definition <laughs> it really makes you think about what it means to be human what makes you say that beyond the basics Beyond the superficial, I'm convinced there's something with even greater value. You have provided a platform, which is not necessarily restricted to our digital progeny, but a means of actual survival. It's my sincerest belief that we can go on living through the reality of continuity. <laughs> so, yeah, that's what I was talking about. Continuity. So, the Simon that we are you know the last thing he remembered before he turned up here was he was having a brain scan and I suppose that's the scan that got uploaded somehow into this diving suit um, and he you know for continuity purposes 2015 and 2103 literally happened within a blip whoa what happened there is this from inside the ark yes that's some Beautiful. early wonders of the world inside Looks a whole lot comfier than this place. Beautiful! Mixed to deciduous forest. Urban park. Like, I suppose the the copies inside the Ark, if you made them real enough, and like, they're a full brain scan, aren't they? So they're exactly the same. You know, they wouldn't realize that they weren't to the original continuity wise they would have had a scan and then have woken up in the arc I suppose right this is stuff that I don't understand this is basically how they built it closest to Sun ideal arc orbit max distance for sufficient performance so this is Earth so basically they want it to orbit kind of the same orbit as Earth really Okay. Uh, no, that's what I just looked at. Okay, calibration survey. Welcome! If you are reading this, you have successfully entered the ARC. This survey is designed to give the developers a better understanding of your subjective experience and how to improve your well-being. Please continue with the survey. How would you describe your physical condition? Why is it highlighted on this? Uh... Hmm. Okay. Whoops. If I just woke up, how would I feel? Alien? Fake? No. Alien. Alien. How would you describe your mental condition? I feel altered. How would you describe your senses? Uh, lacking? I suppose you wouldn't realize that though, would you? Maybe, yeah? How would you describe the sensation of your new condition? Uh, something is wrong, it's disconcerting. Maybe? Are you troubled by the fact that you are no longer strictly human? Somewhat? How do you perceive your new existence? It's a direct continuation of my previous... It's like a new chapter. Do you think this new existence will be a life worth living? Well, yeah, because it's the only... The whole point of the arc is that it will be the only existence. Uh, yes? Yes. Just as much though? With less meaning? I mean, I suppose it has more meaning, you know, hist historically wise. Uh... If I woke up and knew I was a scan, do I feel like my... Yes, I would. 
Yeah, sure, why not? Would you rather be removed from the project? No. Your answers have been saved. Thank you for participating, the ARC team. You're welcome. Right, tracker. Uh, I select. A tracker homed in on the ARC. Oh, that's clever. I wonder if uh, I thought of that. Does it still work? I really need to know what happened to it. I think so. It's doing something at least. Okay, so it's still on Where Earth. Is it? Hold on. I'm trying to find it. The ocean? Please let it be safe. Oh, hell yeah! Fast square straight away! Uh. Okay, so they wanted to get it to fly. Okay. Tau? It's in Tau. Um. This complicated area here. Yes. Do I need to know exactly where it is? It's at a site named Tau. Oh, no. It's on Earth. It's so close to Phi, they almost made it. Damn it, it God, won't it's make far it away. to in that state. A couple of decades at most. That's not much to build a future. If we got to it, could could we get on the Ark? I the infirmary, site Tau. It's exactly flexible at the moment. Well, I could take you there. I, I'm, I'm flexible. I'll right. take us there. I can move, jump, swim, sort of. You're stuck in the door opener, the Omni tool. I'll just carry you there and you'll show me what to do. That sounds really risky. Besides, I don't like the idea of you carrying me around. We don't really have another option, on, do we? Catherine, this is what you wanted to do, your final mission. Let's launch the Ark. We would need to find a way to get into the Abyss. Can't take the climber without a power suit. We probably have to go to Theta and pray the Dunbat's still working. Okay, so we go to Theta. I don't know, it's pretty far. Catherine, look around. What else is there to do? You know what? I found a sunken vessel just outside. Bet that could take us to Theta. Really? Didn't look completely out of action. It even lit up a little when I tried the Omni tool on it. Okay then, let's have a look. I'll just eject from this thing. Don't forget to take me with you. Can I pull the Omni tool out? Wait, wait, wait. Okay, just be sure to plug me in again at some point. Don't worry. You got it. Good luck, Simon. Ah, glorious. So we need to find that vessel, the emergency vessel again. Uh, it's this way. <sighs> you know, Simon and Catherine actually balance each other out quite well. Like, uh, whenever she's depressed, he gets optimistic and vice versa. They're surprisingly well suited for each other. It's so freaking loud! Well, that's all for today, folks, but the story will continue. I hope you all have a wonderful afternoon, evening, morning, or whatever it is, wherever you are. I will see you all in the future. TTFN and cheerio! Just listen.